So this is my strained product. I just put a little bit less than a third a cup of beeswax in here and see how it's melting. And once it's totally melted, then I do a test to see if it has enough. I take it off the heat. I don't want to mess it up right now. Take it off the heat. And I put a little teaspoon in the freezer to make it nice and cold. And then I dip that little teaspoon barely in and I see if it, if it coats it and it's it kind of tells me how stiff it's going to be. So let me check it real quick. So I checked it and it could use a little bit more. So I'm going to repeat this process because I don't want the lotion to be, or the sap I want to say, I don't want it to be too runny. So I'm going to take another little teaspoon and I'll put that back in the freezer and I put my little bowl back on the double. So I have a little pot and I have a stainless bowl and the product is in there. So I'm going to add a little bit more. I don't want to add all of it. And I turn the flame back on. Of course it doesn't want lights to the thing. There we go. And then I repeat that same process. I stir it. Now when you look at the water itself, the water in here will start to come to a boil. The reason I don't do it directly on the heat is because I don't want to kill the properties of the of the cannabis. So I just stir it until it's dissolved. It's almost there. I don't want to see any of the little wax pencils still floating. Then it's dissolved. Turn the flame off. And that bowl is pretty hot, so be careful when you touch it. Make sure you don't dump it. I just dip my pot holder in there, dang it. You have to put that, flush it out right away. That was set hard. So, stirring that. I get my little spoon that I made cold. Just barely dip it in there. See how it solidifies? If it solidifies enough to my taste, like when I take it, I rub it on my hand so I don't waste it. And that to me seems to be enough. So now, I put a little bit of vitamin E oil in here. It doesn't need to be a lot. Probably have to order some more. And I got some really good lavender oil. It's expensive though. But you don't need to get the expensive stuff. A couple of drops. And I stir that together. And I take a smell. Yeah, could use a little bit more. It's 
put a little couple of drops in at a time. It's hard to mask that smell because it's pretty strong. But if I can, I try to do it. Yeah, I think that's okay. And then I fill it in these little containers. I don't know if I'm going to get four, but I'll try. 